Got some exciting symbols to give away. I also have some exciting symbols to sell as well. We're gonna take a look at my dynamic fireplace tools as well as my free fireplace symbols. The free fireplace symbols were created from the dynamic fireplace tools. So let's take a look at those free ones first. Let's take a look at those. So I've got Rab's fireplace as symbols. And we're gonna see here, we're gonna place a couple of these. I'm including six of these fireplaces in this pack. So all very good looking fireplaces. Keep in mind, a bunch of different style of fireplaces. So you can always change the materials on these and get a number of other different fireplaces out of these tools. So all of these fireplaces were built from a dynamic set of tools that I have for sale. And we're gonna take a look at that in just a second. Let's just pop a couple of lights in this view. We're in Chief Architect X14 only. I'm gonna designate that we've got Four lights here running two side by side. Let's get back into this view and turn on PBR and see how nice these look. Very cool looking stuff. Now let's take a look at some of the, what these tools do. These are all built out of cabinets with a bunch of different special symbols in them to make them work. So that if we resize these cabinets, you can see it's dynamically resizing the symbol itself. Grab a couple of these different base fireplaces to take a look at what they are. Here's a typical brick fireplace. I resize that to anything I want. Another really nice thing about this is I've got a bunch of different components that can be changed out as well. So let's, let's look at a few of the different components that we have. We have a bunch of different moldings so that you can change, say, just the lower molding here. There's actually a two molding stack versus that upper molding and get a completely different fireplace very quickly. We can also change the countertop overhang of these moldings. And of course, our resizing works really well. Let's delete this one, get onto a different type here. Let's try this one. There are five base, or excuse me, seven base fireplaces that you may need that you can start from and then start modifying from there. So we can obviously change those top moldings out. We can also change panels on these. So let's take a look at some of these face panels. I can drag and drop new face panels and quickly make a completely different fireplace. Drop another one of these base fireplaces in. See here's here's one with a brick wrap. Get into our our different face panels. Change this out to a bridge port. Look at that. Very quickly change these out. Change our molding out. Get a relief there. Get oversized moldings. can even change our overhang to not have any uh, double stack molding, just a single stack molding. I also include a ton of materials in here. I mean, you can make a thousand fireplaces with these tools, if not more, very easily. I created about 13 that I included in this kit. Let's take a look at a, some of the example ones that I've got here. all require that you have a cutout in the wall and then something to block the light like my fireplace stack that's also included in this kit which is a dynamic two cabinet stack with some taper tools as well you can add a taper to this lower section select it it's a sink so if we tab into it concentrically resize it or we can even create an offset fireplace, look at that. This is one of my favorites. All these 
fireplaces have dynamic doors. You can open up your door. You can see there there's a frame around there. Again, if we turn on PBR, these look really good in PBR. Anyways, if you're just picking up that free pack, enjoy. Give me some feedback. I hope you love them. They're really good looking symbols. And then hit me up if you've got any questions about the advanced pack. Appreciate it.